hey guys welcome back to another video it's mark here forex and we're doing our jpjpy analysis so previously we had a double bottom formation in this particular area and we can see that this area is a buy zone so what happened was that on friday we had another retracement to this area we can see that okay the we had now a what we call a change of structure because when price went up price came back to this particular area and we are seeing that price is trying to retrace back to this area like this that's what we're seeing price trying to do because when price fell to this temporal buy zone we saw that we have a tweezer tweezer bottom formation around this particular area this is a four hour time frame perspective so what do we expect to see we want to see price drop to this particular area like this if price drops to this area with a strong candle and it breaks this area it means that we are going bullish on gp jpy that's what i think about this pair but you know we are still bearish on the higher time frame because if you can see the trend line the trend line has not yet been broken that's why i want to see how price will get to this particular area if i see price break this trend line strongly then and also break this zone strongly then i'll be all bullish on jvp jpy i'll take a long position around this area like this and hopefully it gets to a good area also if price gets to this area maybe today or tomorrow and we see that price is not able to hold this this um, trend line let's say price retraces or let's say price reverses at, the, at this trend line we'll see it fall back down to this particular area and we'll have an m-shaped formation to prove to us that gpjpy is still bearish this is the four time frame perspective of this particular pair so let me delete this one let's go to the 15 minutes time frame 15 minutes time frame we can see that today jpjpy is bullish because um, when price fell to this particular zone we can see that this area became a new buy zone see what happened here previously when price came to this area we saw that there was a rejection by the bulls also when price fell to this area again we are seeing another tweezer bottom formation in this area and this area was a previous resistance area but what happened the resistance area was being broken it was being broken yeah this resistance area was being broken with a strong candle and this is a strong candle here so we're going to see what happens if price is able to meet this area this particular resistance area that is smaller time frame resistance but i'm looking at the bigger time frame picture i want to see how price will reach this particular area and react in this area so for now if i'm to trade gpjpy i'll be bullish on gpjpy up to this area and and when price gets to this area i want to see what happens if it, if it breaks strongly i will hold my bull my buys but if it doesn't if you start reacting bearish in this area like what happened here previously then i'm a sell so that's my perspective on jp jpy what do you think about this video please drop your thoughts in the comment section if you're new subscribe leave your thoughts and we're gonna keep making more videos like this thanks for watching bye